Hello viewers and my dear parents, I am Dr. Anucha Bharti from Unitas Hospital, OMR. Today I want to tell you related small tips related to your newborn. To your, so this video is specifically dedicated to newborns. So when the parents come to the clinic OPDs, I see a lot of doubts and concerns are there in parents' mind. Well, that is quite acceptable, but more than that, they are more confused because there are a lot of inputs, lot of forceful ideas from the parents, grandparents and full families. So let me clear out few doubts which you need to manage with your newborn babies. First thing, when your newborn is born, only thing that he can do is crying. So crying is not abnormal in a newborn. It's a normal reaction to everything a newborn can feel. So when a baby cries, just try to console your baby. See if the baby has passed any urine or motion. Third, put the baby on your breastfeeding. And fourth, even after that, if still the baby is crying, just try to console as much as possible. Even after that, if you feel the baby is still not in a comfortable zone and still the crying doesn't look normal to you, definitely consult your pediatrician. As soon as the baby is delivered, you should start breastfeeding. Now this breastfeeding should be given only after every two hourly gap. You should not breastfeed your baby within two hours even if the baby is crying. You should give a gap of two to hours so that the baby's digestion goes well. After you are done with your breastfeeding, you should always put your baby vertically and pat from below to top so that whatever gas they have taken around with the breast milk, it all comes out. So ideally we say it as burping for 8 to 10 minutes. Third thing, if your baby has passed urine, it is a good sign of hydration. It means that your baby is taking your breastfeed well. Now, how many counts of urine is important? Important is 6 to 8 times of urine in 24 hours is definitely a very normal reaction to adequate breastfeeding. Related to motion, if your baby has not passed motion for a continuous stretch of a week, that is normal. If your baby has passed motion 8 to 10 times in a day, that is also normal. So both extremes are normal, either it is 0 or it is 100. Next. You should not give any top feed like any powder formula, any water, honey or anything at least for up to 6 months of age. That is the reason we promote exclusive breastfeeding till 6 months of age. So exclusive itself means only and only your breastfeeding. Now sneezing and hiccup both are normal in a newborn. It doesn't mean the baby has a cold, the baby has an indigestion, anything like that. It is just a normal protective reflex for baby. If the baby has too many hiccups, you can just latch on your breast and give the breast feeding. For a sneezing, you don't need to do anything. And most important, if at all you feel that your baby is not looking well, you have a sixth sense that your baby is not looking fine to you, definitely don't hesitate to consult your pediatrician because a baby's life is very, very critical and delicate. Have a good day and take care of your baby the way you want to. Thank you.